Today's tip is how to render transparent video. Um, what you need for this tip is an empty composition, a transparent PNG file or some other asset, and that's it. Let's get started. First, I'll create a new composition. I'll name it Transparent Render. I'll make it HD resolution and 10 seconds long. Next, I'll import a transparent ping. I'm going to resize the ping and I'll add a little animation so we can see the motion against the underlying video. I'll also add a static text element so we can see how that looks as well. I'll cover that type of animation in another daily tip. This is the important part here. In the render tab, click on the output module link. This brings up the output module settings. Select quick time for the format, then click on the format options. Select PNG from the drop down, then under the video output, select RGB plus alpha for the channel and press OK. That's all you need to do. Now just press the render button and render a .mov file, a QuickTime file. Next I'll bring in a, a low res video file to use as a background and I'll import the .mov file we just made. Then you can drop the imported .mov on the background and preview. Notice that the transparency is respected. Let's take a moment to review the major steps. 1. Import a ping or some other transparent asset, text, PSD, video, or work. Create any animation you need or just leave the file static if that's what you need and add it to the render queue. Click on the output module, select the QuickTime format, make sure to set the video codec to PNG, select RGB plus, al plus alpha as the channel, and that's it. You just rendered a transparent video. 